resume the crash position. Hold on tight. Take a deep breath for a cartoon cramaganza. Take you inside and turn the pages. Here are your hosts, Henry and June. Howdy, Kablam Skateers. I'm Henry, and this would be my co host, June. Okay, June, the dancing part of the show is over. Can't help it, Henry. I've just got happy feet. Ba -da -ba -da 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 June, America is waiting for the show to start. Okay. How's that, America? I extend my most sincere apologies. June, the writers spend hours preparing the script, and, and the production crew works really hard to put this show together. And now you're just blowing them all off. How do you think they feel? What can I say? The rhythm is gonna get ya! And so are Sniz and Fondue! I will take this and sell it on the mobile chair black market. <laughs> Help! Stop! Wheelchair thief! <laughs> hey, Fadooski! Check out my new hose attachment! The Water Wizard! No other nozzle harnesses the power of H2O with such intensity and clarity of purpose. Whatever, Fruit Nut. A clean home is a happy. Hey, Fondue, bet you I can fill old lady Schnaufman's bird bath from back here. Ready? Aim! Water! Sniz, look what you've done! All the badness! The water wizard is too mighty. Sniz, regard! He cannot be! He, he can walk! It's a miracle! Sniz, the water wizard healed him! Pardone? Heal me! Heal me! Okay, but what's wrong with you? Everything. Hot flashes, anhedonia, Munchausen by proxy, hypochondria. Fonduski? It worked! I'm completely healed! <laughs> Sniz, this nozzle is a great gift. We must exercise its curing power wisely. Hold them, Fonder! Hang on, Peppy! I'll cure that nasty ick forever! I'll get it. Hello? Who is it? Morning, madam! It's the blind man! Sniz, a blind man! Dirty drapes dragging you down? Why not consider the Venetian alternative? Blind man? Can you see? Wiggling how many finger digits? <gasps> Fruit's alive. Not only can he see, but he can operate a motor vehicle. <gasps> Look, Fondue! He left behind his special wood. We could put it over our windows for privacy and to block out the light. Later, Sniz. 
Your gift is too precious to keep to ourselves. Right now, we're going to heal the world. Ladies and sick people, your suffering is over. Behold, the wondrous Water Wizard! Who's first? Step right up! One squirt will do ya! Uh, I'd like to have my arm healed, please. You got it, fella! Oh! Could you do something about my male pattern baldness? <laughs> but this isn't what I meant! The hose will heal you all! Everybody feel better! It's nothing but a garden hose with a fancy nozzle. They're fakes! Charlatans! My arm hurts! Let's get it! I get yeah. it! We're gonna get up there! Yeah! yeah. yeah. Yes. Hey, I'm so sorry. Oh, now, now, let's not do anything radical. I'm done with the healing game. Me too, bunch of ingrates. But at least we got these cool mobile chairs! Race you down the hill, fun dooster! <laughs> if you thought that last cartoon was Kabalama Lama Ding Dong Delicious, well, friend, you are not alone. In fact, in a blind taste test, four out of five finicky TV viewers prefer Kablam. To show how we got our results, Henry will take the Kablam oh, challenge. challenge. Are you ready, sir? We're good to go here, June. Then let the challenge begin. What will Henry like more? Kablam or a leading name brand soft drink? <laughs> this one tingles. Mmm, glassy good. Mmm, just a little hint of citrus. Nice. No doubt about it. This is the taste that'll keep me coming back for more. Well, what do you know? Kablam! And no unpleasant aftertaste. Just like Action League now. Dateline, Refrigerator Museum of Art, where a fiendish art thief has been stealing paintings right out from under their magnets. Action League, thank goodness you're here. If anything happens to this Timmy original, we'll have to cancel our big opening tomorrow. No worries, sir. The Action League is on it. It's an honor to guard such a brilliant painting. I love Timmy's use of color to redefine space. I like the shoes. They're purple. Ah, uh, what do you Philistines know about art? Hey, look! Thunder Girl copied Timmy! This I gotta see. That forgery gets an F. Art happened to be my best subject in school. Ha, huh, right. Excuse me. <gasps> Whoopsies. Action League, now. Today's episode, Art of Thunder. We find our heroes getting dressed down for messing up. Blast it! If we don't get that painting back before the big opening, we'll be in more trouble than a Rembrandt on a roller coaster! Time for plan B. Moments later, the League stows away inside a sculpture by the renowned artist Terracotta. Ouch! Your flipper's in my face. Well, your hair's in my mouth. Excuse me, Chief, but how is this going to get that painting back? When the art thief steals his priceless work, he'll unwittingly take us to my texture. Now make room! Oh, 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 oh. By those. Later that evening, the League's operation is threatened by an unforeseen development. Hey, guys, I, I gotta take an action, Tinkle. Hold it in! Oh, great. No! Don't you dare! Someone's coming! 
Oh, joy! It's Terracotta's Masterpiece Kitty! I must have it for my collection. <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! I'm getting seasick! Oh, oh, no. oh. Ouchie! Oh. Get my tongue! Slippery little devil, aren't you? Ouchie! My spine! I can't feel my leg! Next up, my personal art collection. Ow! It's just not my night. Later, in an art lover's lair. Is anyone still alive? No. Anyone seen my legs? The painting. I can see my tetcher on that table over there. The finest art in the world is now mine. And no one could look at it but me. <laughs> Think again, Mayor. Action League, away! <laughs> What's this? My priceless work full of action jerks? Freeze, Mayor! You're under arrest! Hold it right there. One more step, and this masterpiece is masterpieces. Blimey! He's holding my tetra over a paper shredder! Can our heroes dissuade his dishonor from dismembering, dispainting? Find out at the action-shattered conclusion of Action League Now. Go wake your Grammy! There's more Kablammy! Still to come, Prometheus and Bob. Life with Loopy! And when we return, more Action League Now! Right here on Kablam! Action League Now! A painting jacked, a Trojan cat Cracked with my tetcher teetering on the brink of tatters. One clean shot, Chief. One clean shot is all I need. Okay, but don't miss. The entire art world is depending on you. Ha <laughs> ha, you don't have that guts. This painting's worth millions. Make that thousands. Uh, try pennies. Third time's the charm. Uh-oh. Ah. Yes, it hurts. Blast it! That painting's more shredded than a box of shredded weed in a shredder! What are we gonna do now? Later that day. Chief, I can't thank you enough for taking such good care of my tetra. I was nothing, really. Well, Thunder Girl. I guess we owe you an apology. Your painting saved our hides. I like the way Thunder Girl uses color to redefine space. Mmm, snackers. Thanks, guys. It is pretty good, isn't it? I love weenies. Oopsies. The end. Action League Now, USDA certified action, just like... Admit it. You thought Henry was a goner there. That's because of the mood-altering power of the music sting. Thanks, Mr. Soundman. In the world of filmed entertainment, the music sting is used to punctuate the emotions of a scene. We call that one the pants sweater, and I think you can see why. <coughs> ah, cheeky trumpets. That's the sting that tells you Henry's done something embarrassing. It's orange soda, okay? Jerks. <coughs> Uh-oh. That heartbroken Delta Bluesman is the sting that tells us Henry's in one of his moods. <laughs> nice work, Mr. Sound Guy. The pants sweater does it again. It's iced tea, okay? This is my favorite music sting of all. The one that tells us it's time for Prometheus and Bob. 900,000 years ago, an alien videotaped his attempts to educate a caveman. The Prometheus and Bob tapes. 
Tape 256, Treehouse. Hola, amigos. Be with you in uno momento. On your mark, get set, slap! Ow! That's it, I quit. I don't get it. I practice and practice, but I can never beat you. Don't be so hard on yourself, Hanksky. You win some, you... Well, actually, you never win some. I must be doing something wrong. I know, I'll study the game film, just like my hero Clyde, the Glide, Drexler would do. Danny, can you re-rack that one, please? Danny, let's not, and say we did. <laughs> you cheated! Okay, okay, I'm, I'm sorry, Henry. I absolutely swear on a stack of comics, I'll never do it again. The days are getting shorter, the nights are getting colder. Time to put away the baseball bat and get out the galoshes. Yup, winter's on the way, folks. And no one's more bummed out about it than my sister, Loopy. Hmm. Winter's gonna be a big frozen flop. You can't have any fun when there isn't any sun. Those guys have the right idea. They're flying south for the winter. Some ducks have all the luck. What's with you, fella? Why aren't you heading for the tropics with the rest of your fancy feathered friends? Because I'm a Canadian wingless duck, that's why. Every winter those guys fly south and I'm stuck here by myself. Sounds like you want to get away just as bad as I do. Wait. Just because we haven't got any wings doesn't mean we can't fly. Come with me, duck. I got an idea. By the way, my name's Mike. How's it going, eh? My name's Lupicia, but you can call me Loopy. Welcome to Fly By Night Travel. How may I help you? We want to fly south for the winter. Super. How about this? 
Eight days in Jamaica, including hotel, limousine, and airfare. Only $2,000 per person. Sounds good, eh? I got five bucks. Oh, I see. Well, in that case... We hope you've enjoyed flying with us today. On behalf of everyone at Vertigo Airlines, we'd like to say, bombs away! Woohoo! Sun City, here we come. Last one to the beach is a sack of seaweed. Oh, nice going, eh? I thought we were flying south for the winter. We did, Mike. We just flew a little too far south. This is the South Pole. Ah, oh, I should have known this would have happened. Life's a poke in the eye for a guy who can't fly. Now cut it out, you two! Penguins! That's right, penguins. Flightless birds who live in sub-zero temperatures every gosh darn day of the year. And you don't hear us complaining about it, right, gang? <laughs> Like I always say, if life gives you ice, go ice skating! You thinking what I'm thinking? Last one, there's a frozen fish stick. had the wildest winter week ever. But I better be getting home now. Hey, Mike, are you coming? <laughs> hey, hey, uh, Loopy, you know, I've been thinking. Maybe I'll stick around a little longer. After all, somebody's got to teach these web heads how to fire a slap shot. Right, team? <laughs> So Loopy caught a ride on a passing fishing boat and was home before the first snowflake hit the ground. Anybody for some halibut? Ever since she's been back, Loopy sure has changed her tune about winter. But as for the rest of us, well, we're looking forward to an early spring. Welcome back. You've seen the TV show. You've considered buying the t-shirt. Now check out Kablam! The Game! Let's give it a trial run. Wow! Kids are gonna love this. They sure are. Hey, this isn't what we talked about at the game concept meeting. It works for me. June, this is ridiculous. Kablam the game should be like Kablam the show. When you're right, you're right, Henry. I'm going to settle this problem pronto. Around here, when I say jump, people say how high. Ah! Ah! Perfect. Now it's just like the show. Join us again next time. Same Kablam time, same Kablam network.